Boom Pal Zach, we're going to do a video on the Power XL Duo Nutra Sealer. I ordered this from Amazon. There's been infomercials on. But uh, I didn't order it from the infomercial. But I was watching the infomercial, and the infomercial comes with like a bunch of the bags for sealing. So, oh, oh, look. Yeah. Yeah. Bags it said me. three on the infomercial. This is this three is bags. two. Yeah. There you go, three. Oh, it's a lot bigger than like what I imagined. Oh wait, look. Two, three, four. four. Five. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, take it out of the bags and stuff. Okay, so it comes with two bags. And I guess this, like, so you can reuse these little bags. One's big and one's smaller. And then this, I guess you stick it in there and somehow. Well, I haven't really. Th this is all, you know, new to us. And, you know, on the infomercial to make it look so easy, you know. Oh, here it is, the bag. And zip, zip, easy. zip. And yeah. so we're going to demonstrate. I bought these steaks from Sam's and I'm going to separate um, two in each bag and seal them up. So we have like three dinners for, uh, yeah. so this is how, and we're done. This is how, <laughs> <laughs> this is how I keep them now. I like getting these uh, sirloin tips. <laughs> yeah, so I figured that this one. That one's been there. That one thing was hiding at the back of the refrigerator. Yeah, it's been like don't look that bad. three months. Okay. So it says to leave at least three inches above the the contents. Or more if it's thicker. Yeah, and it's thicker. So and then there's this little vacuum seal edge right here. Uh, the textured side of the bag needs to go down, and then both sides of the bag have to go underneath this little vacuum ledge area here. Um, and I'm just going to close now until it snaps. There's a little button on the side that opens it. Oh, wait a minute here, hold on. I'm gonna move this out of the way because that's the little cutter thing. All right, and so I want it to vacuum and seal. All right, first try, here we go. Done? No. Oh, you wait till the light blinks. Okay. Mm. Nice. That's a little good. warm. I like that. Yeah. All right. So, what we have to do is make another bag. Then Here's we're going to the... put pets in there and see how it vacuum seals the pets. All right. The hot dogs. <laughs> hot dogs. All right. So, I'm just going to seal a bag. And that's seal only. This is to make the end of the bag. I'm gonna do like uh, bread. And Have some salad. You gonna okay, vacuum seal salad? So I made the end of the bag. Now I'm gonna make another. I guess I'll do about that size again. So. Now how much are the bags? Is that where they? I get don't know. You? I haven't looked them up yet. So now I'm going to cut the bag. Cut them. And I'm going to place some more stakes in the bag. I don't know if I'm that part. Just kind of slide it down in that little thing there. It's not always as easy as it looks. All right, close lid and then back in and seal. Uh, All right, that was quick. Oh wait, you don't have to cut it. I was fixed to cut it. <laughs> that would have been good. Cut it trying to seal, to seal it there. Okay, so we got okay, next one we should put the seasoning in. We'll do it later. So, uh, we just put a little salt and pepper and some garlic cloves. Cloves, not cloves, not garlic cloves. Cloves. 
Can you see in there? Okay. Yeah. How it goes up underneath that lip thing, a little vacuum. You kind of tuck it down in there and then make sure the textured part's on the bottom. Close it till it snaps. Hit vacuum. Vacuum and seal. Put the seal on it. So now it's blinking. It's time. Still have to wait on this thing to season up with salt and pepper. So nice. You have to just doing steak, or you can use other ones for anything else. And they nice makes it nice and stackable for your refrigerator. Yeah. Oh, or your. Freezer. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna get some bags ready for my hot dogs. So I'm gonna seal only. Okay. So that was really sealed. Oh. What's that? It's garlic clove. And then I'm gonna cut the bag. Right. And then I'm gonna make three bags for my hot dogs. I'm gonna the bottom sands. Dogs, yeah. mm -hmm. Bags. That was pretty quick. I'm tucking the. Sure, it's gonna fix that hot dog. Look, he's gonna be in the way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So. Yeah, I think it's uh, I think you need more room. Yeah, I guess I hit it too much. Put, try to put too many in there. Try, yeah, you try to stick those hot dogs sticking out the top there. <laughs> well, what I'll do is I'll just put these in the refrigerator so we have these on standby. And then I'll reduce some more. Yeah, you got greedy with the bag. <laughs> Can't get greedy with the bags, I guess. We're gonna see if we can get them in there lengthwise. We don't know. With my little bags, I cut. Yeah, the little bags are just a little too small. Oh, gosh, it's not as easy, you know, as infomercial makes it look. That's because you gotta use a lot more bag than they they tell you. Or than what you think. Yeah. Maybe. You're going all minimalist. They're like, no. Get your healthy snatch a bag here. Help it out there. Help it out. <laughs> it's like it's not. Is it doing the same thing again? Maybe it's right. Just give it time. Maybe it just needs a little time. In time. The other ones were done way before this. The steaks were anyway. So what's happening? I think they're need less hot dogs. No. Or bigger, bigger bag. bag. Cut you a bigger bag. Hot. Yeah. 
be careful. They got so it seems the cutter things on the other side. Maybe that maybe that was the problem, but I don't think so. Oh, you just think I'm trying to overfill the bags? Yeah. trouble with these hot dogs. This isn't easy. <laughs> got, got the bag too big, maybe now. I don't know. The bag was too small. Maybe I'm cutting the bag crooked. It's just not going in here right. It needs to be flatter. Pull these away from it. Hey, don't pull too much now. It's supposed to be right. in there. What is it doing? It's got to be under there, not in it, I don't think. Just under it? Yeah. <laughs> we broke it already. Looks like some air coming out of it. I just did it and it worked perfectly on my first time. <laughs> Something I'm doing is not right. Yeah. <laughs> just gotta make sure that you have it down on the ends. At the top. A little extra, yeah. You need to have enough where the food can set down without pulling the bag out. So it's gonna have to Let's be, make one more bag. Have to be longer than this one, but not as long as that one. <laughs> so, see you only. Well, it definitely works better if they're cut longer, but it's still pretty. It's it's kind of difficult to get it just right because uh, I've set it in there a couple times and it wouldn't. Yeah, I thought it was right and then it wouldn't work. So I just sat there and made a bunch of noise and didn't do anything. So I'm gonna put these in the freezer. Okay, so one of the things I really liked on the infomercial were the little individual packets of salad dressing that they showed. So I'm gonna try to uh, reproduce that. Hmm. So first, I'm gonna just. Seal only to make a bag. And you wait. It'll take very long, a couple of seconds. I can So you got these BOGO at Publix. Publix. <laughs> Publix. <laughs> you say okay. tomato. I say so tomato. now I'm gonna just cut off the bag with this right here. Now I'm going to take the dressing. This is ranch. But I like this idea because I always want to like take a salad to work and like take some uh, dressing with me. But I don't want to take the whole bottle. So you take half the bottle. Well now I'm making individual packs. Oh. Alright. So now. Oh, not vacuum and seal. Seal only. I don't know how this is going to work. Let's see. Okay. How does it work? I think what you do is you just uh, put it in there and do... I don't think you can squish it. You got to be able to do that. You gotta yeah. go back and watch the infomercial. <laughs> <laughs> you can, it can, you can like. Hold on. Are you sure about that? <laughs> Seal only. If it catches 
is on fire. Right. It'll be a good video. All right, it's done. See? <laughs> that didn't work. Wow, that worked really well. <laughs> How did they do that? I guess oh. we gotta go back and watch, huh? <laughs> okay, so it did seal some, and then I took the scissors and cut it. And on your um, second attempt. It leaks. So, I don't... We'll look and see how we do it. Right. Okay, so um, <laughs> I'll just be quiet about what I just what just happened, but we just watched another video. <laughs> Did not read directions. And so we're gonna do seal. So this is gonna show you what you're supposed to do. What you're supposed to do is seal each one like that, and then fill it up. up. So however much you want to. So. Now how do you fill it up whenever it's sealed? Maybe there was some. here. Let's just I'll cut some off here. I think you can cut it to the length that you want. Because you can do whatever you want to do like that. And then seal the ends? Yeah. So I'm just gonna So oh wait, 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 you seal it lengthwise. Or I just wait, hold on. No, it doesn't like that. You do it like that. So you turn it this way. And you seal it in there. That way you can pour it in the end, then you can seal the end. You do what? Stand back. Seal Go it. Go ahead and record. Let's record. Alright, so you it. seal it and you turn it sideways. Yeah. Then you cord, make cord it off like that. Compartment. <clears throat> I don't think it'll shut when you got it. Yeah. Maybe try I to push it, it all the way long. back to the back. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Maybe not. I cut it too long. Yeah, you cut it too long. So, just take some off. Waste. I hate wasting. That's why you buy this thing. to not waste. Cheap. cheap on the video. Are you I still recording? Some, I hear some editing coming in. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I hear right. some editing. All right, you can probably pause it. I'm just going to seal two more places. Okay. Um, you All right, people, so don't make it too skinny. You people because, at home, uh, learn from our mistakes. Remember, we're just, we're just learning how to do this. So. And we are screwing it up royally. <laughs> so don't make the... Don't make it popsicle size. Yeah, you want, <laughs> unless you're doing a liquid, it might be a little bit easier with the thick uh, sauce. I don't know about that. And then, like, when I did it like that, it doesn't like the sauce, so we're going to see if it's going to seal with the sauce right there. Yeah, Otherwise, I'll try squishing it out of the way. <laughs> All right. This is funny. Is it going to Seal gonna only. Might do it twice just to. Get this is nice. I'll be able to take these to work on yeah. my diet. Yeah, that's nice. All right, it says it's done. Yeah, looks like it actually cleared those this time. Squeeze them. Oh, one of them. Uh, <laughs> Look what you did. Well, it's not too bad. I mean, I don't think it's going yeah, to fill take it in the to work. lunchbox. So then you just cut them apart. It's got the, the duo seal. You can share it with somebody. Let's see. Would you like to kiss, share my ranch dressing? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. I don't either. <laughs> 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 Looks like it's leaking on the side there. Where? Oh, right there. Well, it shouldn't be. Shouldn't be. <laughs> just... <laughs> Put these in the refrigerator. It would be I would like it better if it did like where you wouldn't have to like separate it like that. Because on the commercial they don't really show that. You know, it makes it look separate. so much. Yeah, where you uniform. Just, yeah, just like you can just easy, well, with, easy with peasy. You, just with practice, I'm sure it's, it gets easier. Yeah, maybe. It does. So after you finished all these rolls, <laughs> and you buy some more rolls, you'll be good at it. Recording. Make sure you have it in there far enough because it missed a spot. So yeah, I don't know. That's what she said. 
<laughs> Sorry, that was just too easy. <laughs> you don't want it missing a spot. <laughs> can in there. Uh, got enough bag for the can. We're going to test the, the strength of it. It's got to go under. The whole thing? Yeah. It's got to go underneath that little... Yeah. I don't know if you got to tuck it in there. It's just got to go underneath it. This is where it gets quirky, folks. It might be alright. We'll see. Vacuum. And... Uh, yep, that's no, is that... Yes. <laughs> oh my. Nice. Yeah. Is it gonna keep vacuuming though? Probably. Because I don't think, like on the commercial, like yeah. they didn't show it being sealed off. Yeah. I don't think it's gonna seal. Well, it's probably because you don't have a bag to seal it either, so it's probably pulled out. That's more. true. If you did a longer bag, it probably worked. Yeah, well, that's pretty good though. I mean, yeah. seriously. Yeah, that's pretty good. I mean, that's that's impressive. I mean, who who can cr who can actually crush a can like that? I mean, that's like strong, you got to have strong hands. <laughs> nice. How about that? Maybe that's right, just else? something okay. that's now we super have easy to do. The yeah. salad with the we bought the salad at Sam's, and we always end up wasting the salad because um, it's wasteable. Because there's so much salad, and now we got to figure out how to do this. So. Let's, uh, right. Okay, so this is what you do. You um, put this in here. These bags are washable and reusable, so do not throw them away, away even though they look like uh, Ziploc bags. <laughs> All right, so then you put this in here. We used to here. wash Ziploc bags, didn't we? What am I supposed to do with this? I don't know. You're the one that read the directions. You need to go back and read the directions? Yes. Okay, so these are actually microwavable too, but Ooh. we're not going to microwave salad. So no, okay, now you just apparently you just put it right over the top mm. and then hit vacuum only. Well, that's working. <laughs> you sure? That's what you just showed me on the video. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the directions. <laughs> you know what? Oh, that's doing good, hold on. No, it's not. Well, it's not doing anything. Get it off. Look at it. Look how tight it is. I don't want to come off. Well, what? What did you do? put it on there? Whole cans? <laughs> no, just for this. Now I don't want to come off. Uh, what are you going to do? I, I think it needs to go on that one. Look, it says back you out. Oh. Uh, well, it's out. Uh, is that back you in? I guess. Well, so you didn't read the directions again. You need to go back and read the directions again. You said you had the right this, one. I didn't think it would matter. All but right. apparently there's a little thing that says back out. I mean, I, how is anyone supposed Sounds to know like that like these are not supposed blower. to be? Yes. I, I thought they were the same thing. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. All right. Let's hear me. Oh, you got to plug it in. Keep unplugging it. What are you unplugging it for? To get it to go stop. All right. All right. Make sure it's sealed. It is. All right. Sure it is. You hold it on there you go. I was actually doing something, yeah. I don't think. You gotta hold it on there. I don't know about this. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can it give, stopped. I can give myself hickeys. <laughs> you want that. And that. Well, he leaves my he Is it working? Now it is. Oh, it's just big. <laughs> I guess she didn't say that. <laughs> well, that's interesting. Now, does it squish the lettuce so it like, makes it gooey? Well, you, whenever you are done getting the as much as you want out, apparently you just take this off and it's Stay. Stay. Interesting. Yeah, I probably did too much. I'll probably mess the lettuce yeah, up. Yeah, probably squished them. 
don't know. But I like that because I always like let lettuce rot. So always lettuce rot. Yes. Okay, so when you go to take this off, mm -hmm. it's not so easy. It really wants to stick on there. So be careful because last time I went I almost broke this off. So I mean, what should you do? Is, like put some oil on I have no idea. No. I don't know what to do. Th these are things Cut they don't tell you on the infomercial. <laughs> Maybe they do. It's I don't want to the cut it. There it is. <laughs> there it goes. It's probably in the manual. And just you just have to it. get it off of there like that. The last thing I want to try to do is see if this fits in a drawer easily. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the candle brass slash brass knuckles drawer. <laughs> you never know. You might have to get somebody. All right. Perfect. Well, let's see about that. Oh, yeah. I don't know I'm if it's going to shut. Might have to take some brochures out of there. I like it. Me too. Stores away? Yeah. Perfect. Boom Pals out. Like, subscribe, comment, and share.